this point, I'm just waiting for these dudes to show up. So I can just kill them over and over so I can hopefully get my last drop and we can continue on. That would be nice. It's like, these dudes are super common and now that I'm trying to farm them, they're not common at all. Just my luck. Well, that's okay. Like I said, sometimes you gotta entertain yourself in some ways. That's why I say a lot of weird and goofy things. It's just me trying to, like, not be bored by the thing I'm doing. Because sometimes, yeah, even though I love playing games, like, sometimes shit can be a little... Not engaging. A little not engaging? That's weird. A little... I guess boring really is the only way to say it. Like, they don't engage me too much. So I have to, like, stop and, like, do something to, like, engage my brain because, like... If I don't, then I just get really bored and don't want to play the game, and I don't want to do that to myself. Don't want to do that. Uh. Look at that, man. Yesterday, all I got were... Hill Anglers. Like, no joke. And now, they're super rare. Today. Don't know what's going on, but it's dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Squirrels is dumb. Uh, but it's like you gotta, you gotta grind, or else you're not gonna learn your spells. Come on, man. This shit is getting frustrating now. Cause like in my head I'm thinking, man, I made all this banana pastry just so I could get to the final part of the dungeon and be fully healed. But I can't do that because I have to stop and grind these stupid stones out, so... I'm just gonna not voice my frustrations because if I do, it's just toxic and unhelpful to anybody. But here's what I will say. Don't play this game. This game blows. It's not worth your time. In my humble opinion, it's not worth your time. The story is lackluster, the combat is lackluster. The grinds in this game are more annoying and really unnecessary than other games. Like, I could just keep saying that until I'm blue in the face. And now I just kind of like turn my brain off. This probably will go on Twitch, but it probably won't go on YouTube just because it's... A bunch of the same crap over and over. And it's really annoying. But I just have to turn my brain off and chill. Just have to chill. Man, it's so nuts that we've only gotten the quote unquote rare encounters so far. Maybe the Hill Angler was rare all along. Maybe they were the rare ones. And I was just getting lucky every time by encountering them. And like I said, I'm spamming this ability as I can get to learn, so... I can add it to part of... Her compound art heiress arts or whatever they're called. Compound heiress. I probably didn't. I didn't see myself get a stone there. No, I didn't. <sighs> That's okay. Just keep moving. Just turn your brain off. Like, there's not much I can say at this point. Like, trying to say stuff is just going to give me a headache because it's like, I'm not having fun with this. This grind is, like, terrible. And it's like, you don't have to do this, right? You don't have to learn all your spells. It's just convenient that I know them. It certainly doesn't help that the things I have to fight are these annoying ass enemies, too. Like, 
These things are annoying to fight. Didn't see a stone drop from that one, so. Not bad. They had a little fight in them. Gonna have to find another one. But yeah. Day X and Dragon Eel. If you ever come back, I'm really sorry for not seeing your message and not engaging with you. I always feel guilt about that because I feel like people must feel like I'm ignoring them or something, and I'm not. I just didn't. When I looked over, there's lots of purple. Whenever you're on, like, the Twitch stream manager, like, there's lots of purple. So, when I saw your name, I didn't immediately register to me that somebody had chatted. But that's really all I can say right now. Once we move on, I'll have more stuff to say, and I can comments on what's going on but right now I have to grind these stupid stones from these stupid enemies to win my stupid spells and uh, it's not very fun it's actually quite stupid if I say so myself it's like the rate at which I'm encountering hill anglers now is like so tiny Compared to what it was yesterday, I couldn't get away from those dudes. And now it's like, they're all gone. I guess I hunted them all to extinction. There we go. Huh. Let me see if I can get her to silence him. Cause if not, I'm gonna have to like step back a second because he's gonna cast a really high level spell on me. Too late. Like, these casters are so toxic for the game. Like, the rate at which they cast their spells is so dumb. Here, let me go ahead and just go do this, because, like, fucking... My allies cannot be trusted to do anything. Cannot be trusted. It's like, I can't catch a break. Like, I come over here to deal with this guy. Not happening, dude. Come over here to stop this guy. The dude over there runs up and knocks me down. It's like, I can't catch a break. Dude didn't even drop anything, right? No, except Parsley. Like, who cares? Who effing cares at this point, man? Okay, I need to stop. I'm slipping into old habits. I just need to stop. Um, Which moves of hers actually have really, like... Yeah, sure, why not? Or Sword Rain Phantom, I guess. Anything involving Sword Rain has a lot of hits. Still need one more Hill Angler drop, man. Like, that's all I need. It's so bad, this system. I'm not a fan of it. Grinding for building weapons? Okay, that's fine. But, like... Grinding to learn your spells after having a level requirement on top of it is like bad design. Like if we just had access to all the scrolls at the beginning and you just like learned them as you went to new areas and grinded out the monsters there, that would be a different story. Completely different story. But it's not like that. Come on, bring it. 
I need to pay attention to whether or not they drop the stone as soon as I kill them. The thing that sucks about that is they have a lot of health, so you want to prioritize the weaker stuff that's next to them. Really dumb enemy to have to collect stones from, but hey. You gotta do it if you want to learn your spells. Really bad design, this system. Oh, Moses, Moses. I need you to silence this guy at all possible. God damn it, move. It's like I have to kill this guy first or else we're going to be constantly being casted on. So there's no way of knowing that this guy was going to drop it or not ahead of time. And I could have just like stopped the fight. Just stupidly annoying enemies that were once boss enemies that they turned into regular enemies. And it's really stupid. I hate them. I hate when video games do this. Didn't drop it. This is such a toxic system. To me. It's toxic to me. Maybe other people like it, but I don't. Like I said, if we had all the scrolls since the beginning of the game and you knew what you needed to grind, it'd be way easier. Because then you know ahead of time and you can just like focus on it. And if that's all this game was going to be about was grinding monsters, it would be a different story again. But it's not that way. Like, these dudes have, like, how much health is it? 13,000? So, like, it would be bad of me not to kill them last. Because then I knowingly allow their allies to, like, get all their stuff off. It's just shitty design overall. I don't like it. And, you know, like, my brain won't feel right unless I have my spells. So it's like, that's what's compelling me to do this, is my brain. Wish it wasn't that way, but it is. I wish I could not care and just play through the game without getting any spells. Like, but it's not, it's not the case. Not how it is working out. I really do hate this. And I'm never playing this game again. It's not worth, it's barely worth one playthrough. Like, only play through it if you're like a diehard Tales fan and you want to see all the games. But this is on my skip list. From here on out, I'm never playing this game again. Its systems are just too frustrating and unsatisfying. Like, it's not fun. To have to sit here and spend an hour and a half, well an hour at least, Grinding out stones for spells that I couldn't learn otherwise. Mm. Just very unsatisfying experience, man. Watch your backs, they're behind. Literally the same dudes I just ran away from. Can't get a hill angler to save my life here, man. They were all over the place yesterday. Now they're like nowhere to be found because I need them. Ah, oh, this system blows. But I need to stop. I need to stop. But it's like I can't keep quiet because I need to say stuff to show people that I'm talking to the camera. It's a double-edged sword. Because I need to be saying other things. But the only thing on my mind are just how negative this experience is. Thunderblade! 
Like, see, I couldn't counter that move. Oh, finally, we can move on with our lives. That's so nice when that happens. Oh, it's so nice being able to move on with my life. Until the next thing I need to grind, of course. There. Now we can move on. All it took me an hour. What a shit system. Like, I just can't get over how shitty this system is. Now we can just fight stuff like regular. What do you mean? Now we can play the game. Like, the fact that the game auto-aims me at whatever's closest to me is bad design, too. Like, it needs to not do that. Because if my whole strategy is to eliminate a more dangerous enemy, and one enemy gets closer to me than that enemy is for some reason, then it stops me from doing my perp- like, you know, fulfilling my purpose. And then I take extra damage when I shouldn't have, because the game's mechanics actively get in the way of me doing what I want to do. Uh, I guess we'll check this one. Okay, this goes somewhere else. Let's go check the other ones first. The enemies in this area suck to fight. God damn it, get out of my way, dude. Literally every single enemy in here is like a former boss that you just have to fight over and over. With the exception of the Ares, I guess. So to all these green platforms, like this goes up and around by the looks of it, yeah. There's nothing up here. Let me go check the other side. This is just a... It's just a red herring. It goes nowhere. It's there to make you think it goes somewhere. But the real one is all the way at the bottom. This dude's hitbox is too tiny, man. Come on. It's like these dudes, all I care about is doing damage. I ain't, geek. I ain't the person you think I ain't. Well, I'll tell you what. Let me go check over here. No, that's where I've been grinding this entire time, so there's only one way to go. And it just looks like I can go multiple ways. That's fine. Oh, God. God damn it, and they're gonna have to run all the way to the back. Get away from me, dude. I'm tired of your stupid crap. Fucking hill anglers. Now that I don't want you, you're all over the fucking place. Oh, wow, then. <laughs> Who would have thought that literally the next one we'd fight drops another stone? Always when you don't want it. Ain't that the way?
This is the way. Mm -mm -mm. It was a ruse the whole time. This was the only way to go for reals. And surprise, surprise, in the next area we get to, there's going to be these birds called peepits, and I need to farm those. God damn it, wait. Oh. Go. Oh, come on. God damn it. Dude has like one HP. Kill him. Shut up. God damn, I'm so tired of this stupid shit game. Like, you have no idea how freaking annoying this shit is to deal with constantly. What other bullshit can they possibly throw at you? The fuck out of here. Not bad. They had a little fight in them. Shut up. Just everybody's annoying me. Just shush. It's like can't kill shit fast enough. Let me put this shit on the ground that you gotta either put a stupid charm on to avoid, lol. This is that hard hitting gameplay I've been looking for. 